I'm Spike. My house. And these are my Air Raid sneakers. Tim Hardaway's gonna show us how to shoot when the wind's up. I got skills. It's ugly, but deadly. No ugly lack of spin. Observe the ugly knuckleball action. See the ugly release. Any questions? Yeah. What do you do if it rains? You made a movie. Do the right thing. Jungle fever. She's gonna have it. School days. What up, party people? Kick Squad. It's me, Dante. Back up in the he's a baby. With another video for you guys. But before I continue on, I need y'all to do the usual things that I ask you to do at the beginning of my videos. If you are back, hit that like button. If this is your first time, hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell so you can be alerted on when I go live or when I'm posting new videos. But not only that, below in the description is my Kick Squad. That's right, this is Kick Squad TV. Everybody in the description below is part of the Kick Squad. Hit the links on there, go to their channels, like, subscribe, and hit the notification on them as well, because you never know. When one of us goes live, all of us goes live, and we have some of the most dopest live cops and dope videos weekly on Kick Squad TV spread out through all of our channels. So I appreciate y'all for that ahead of time. Much love. Now, what y'all came here for? You've possibly seen videos on this already. I'm a little late to the game, but I did cop these for a reason. I did cop these for a reason. A week ago today, I went and played ball for the first time since 2019, the end of 2019, before the pandemic, etc., etc. And your boy was was feeling kind of. I was, I, was, I was hurting. I was hurting for certain. But I did bring a pair of shoes with me that by the end of the day, wasn't cutting it. I figured to myself, what shoes can I grab that are old, I can go outside and play in, and you know, everything will be okay. And I know for me, 13s have always been a comfortable basketball shoe for me. So I went and grabbed an old pair of 13s that I had, these babies right here, I figured, you know what, let's give it a go. But before the morning was over, I looked down at my feet and there were some things happening, right? <laughs> so let's go here. As you can see, I don't even see that, that coming apart there, right? And uh, you look at this other shoe, pretty much the same thing is happening right there. Uh, happened on this side also. I was like, yeah, this is pretty much the end of it. But not only that, on my left foot, it started doing this. I was like, oh snap, <laughs> I can't wear these shoes anymore. I can't do it. So <laughs> what I did next was, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and pull the trigger on some new basketball shoes to go play outside in because if I'm gonna be playing, most likely it's gonna be outside because we don't know when the world is gonna open back up. So. What can I play in? I decided to go for the Nike Air Raid. There you have it, as you can see, the Nike Air Raid comes in a classic orange and white Nike box. The Nike on the top, on the sides, et cetera, et cetera. And as you know, on the bottom, you got all your Nike, you know, that blah, blah, blah jargon, et cetera. As you can see, that's my size right there. Air Raid size 12. But not only did I get any old Nike Air Raid, I got the ray gun joints. So before I get to these, I'm gonna let y'all know a little bit of history about the air raid and the ray guns. So first off, 
starting with the Air Raid. I don't know if you guys remember back in the day, Reebok made a black top shoe and it was called Reebok Black Top, right? <laughs> so they did the black top shoe and their commercials had Sinbad out on the basketball court, just talking, being Sinbad, being a, a, a comic, you know, and show guys on the court, on the black top, outside in the cage, outside playing basketball in their Reebok black tops, right? So of course, Nike, not to be outdone, they said, you know what? We need to make a shoe for outside as well. So they went to Tinker, put a sticky note on Tinker's desk. <laughs> it was like, yo, we need an outdoor basketball shoe. So Tinker went to work. And when he went to work, what came out of it was the Air Raid 1. There has been a second version of the Air Raid 2, but the Air Raid 1 has been brought back a number of times, including this past year when they brought back the Air Raids again in the, in the classic black and gray, and they're, they're dropping a white and black one. And they did the Ray Gun. I think there's like a white, black, and red one. Uh, there's the uh, one that replicates the Spike Lee commercial that Nike did for the Air Raids with Spike Lee and Tim Hardaway, and they did a whole campaign or based around Nike's outdoor basketball shoe, which was the Air Raid. You saw Spike Lee's Playground. So they have a shoe that's basically dedicated to that commercial as well. But then here goes one that I have right now, which is the Air Raid Ray Guns, which is about Nike's fictional basketball team, the Roswell Ray Guns. If you see in those commercials, you had a basketball team that consists of Dr. Funk, which was AKA Vince Carter. And you saw other guys in there too, man. Like you saw Jerry Stackhouse. I think Jermaine O'Neal was in the commercial as well. These guys are back in the seventies. I think they chime traveled or something like that. And they ended up in the seventies and you had the soundtrack from Bootsy Collins and uh, George Clinton, you know, Parliament Funkadelic. They had this whole campaign wrapped around the Roswell Ray Guns. They were like a bottom feeder team. And then all of a sudden they got Dr. Funk and these other guys and they started playing out of this world, <laughs> you know? And so there you have it. And the Roswell Ray Guns, it was based off of uh, Roswell, which had to do with like, um, uh, I'm not exactly how that whole thing goes, but it had to do with aliens and things like that. And so Roswell was where that whole thing uh, was name to go down at so that the logo was an alien you know whose head was a basketball and he had the ray guns and it was the roswell ray guns so there you have it with the history of the air raid but also how it tied into the roswell ray gun so they did that for the air raid shoe they also did it for a pair of kyries a pair of dunks and they're dropping a pair of uh of tempos with the air on the side in the Ray Guns color as well. So those should be dropping. Uh, we're in March right now when I'm filming this video. It should be like in like a week or two they'll be dropping those shoes on sneakers. So if y'all are fans of that up-tempo, you can get them in the, in the Roswell Ray Guns colorway. So now on to my shoe. There you have it right there. The Nike Air Raid Roswell in the colors of the Roswell Ray Guns basketball team. You got the black, the yellow, and the orange there. Right there on the strap, it says Air Raid right there. But if you look on the bottom here, you got that black top grip right there. Air Raid going right there for outdoor use only. Same thing with the back side here. You got for outdoor use only right there on the ridges of the back there. So yeah, this, this shoe is made up to be very heavy duty for the outside with the materials. It's, it's if you could feel, if you were able to get your hands on a pair of these, you'll feel the bottoms here. It has a lot of that grip here on the sides of the sole made for the black top there. It has a lot of reinforcing right around the midsole as well. Very hard um, reinforcement right there, going around the back of the heel, along the sides there. Got that extra, get that little hard grip there, right there on the toe. The rest of the shoe here is made up of a black suede. You get the a suede going around the toe box, going along the side panels here as well. And then you got that mesh 
gold right there. And right here, I'm not sure exactly what material this is. It feels like it could be a suede, but it feels like something else. More like maybe a, a weatherproof material of some sort. Feels a little durable right here on there. Now, as you can see up there with the, uh, the, the heel pull, it has the three stars in the colors of the shoe. And then if you look here, let's unstrap this real quick. Let's do a little unstrapping, all right? We'll talk about that also. Comes with one pair of shoelaces, which are white. And then right here on the tongue is the logo for the Ray Guns basketball team, which is the alien head in the form of a basketball. You can see his eyes there and his mouth as well. So you've got that there along with the Nike Air swoosh on the tongue. And this tongue is made of suede. And then as it goes down here, it's a more of a, a mesh material. Pretty plush around the ankles and the heel support and on the inside. And you can see my little sticker in there, but on the inside it says Ray Guns on the inside foot there. And now with this strap, Tinker, when he did the strap here, he wanted to, to make it feel like you're strapping up and getting yourself secure to go into battle. It's really cool. You guys seem ready to do battle and stuff, but full transparency, I've never done battle. I just push some people and run away. There are shoes that I get for a purpose, and this was purchased just for me to go out and play basketball in, and that's what it will be done in. Outside, outdoor, black top basketball. I'm trying to get myself back in shape again, y'all. Last week I went out and I played, and your boy was hurting. I've been sore all week. Today is the first day. It's been almost a week. Tomorrow, me filming this day, this video on a Saturday. The, tomorrow is a Sunday, obviously, which is a week from the time that I played for the first time in over a year. I'm just now not feeling sore anymore. <laughs> so I'm about to go do it to myself again tomorrow morning. But I will be equipped in my air raid. So yeah, I'm pretty pumped about that. Can't wait to put them on. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and put them on and do it on foot real quick. And then uh, maybe I'll let you guys know what happens after I go do battle in my air raids, all right? Let's do this on foot real quick. As you can see, the shoe fits your foot really snug, especially once you lace them up and then you pull the straps around the foot. It really secures around your ankles and then your the heel and the Achilles area of your foot. I think they'll probably do really good out there when you're playing ball, you know, help my legs out, you know, on my feet, my ankles, I got like a bad ankle on the left. My left leg has bad ankles. You know, got sprained that one like back in 2000 and it has not been the same since, but I still been out there. It hasn't sprained again since, but you know, sometimes you can still feel that little, eh, you know, every now and then. But you know, I think they'll do really well. I, I, time will tell. I look proud that you guys know. I'll keep you posted. But before I get out of here again, hit that like button, subscribe, notification bell if it's your first time here. Down below is the Kick Squad. Do the same thing for them too, please. It would be greatly appreciated. It helps spread Kick Squad TV across the YouTube platform. So I appreciate that, y'all. And until next time, much love, God bless, stay fresh.